We're live from the Neurologic Relief Center in Fayetteville, Arkansas. And uh, today is really a bittersweet day for me. Marty is graduating and going home to California. And you have an amazing story. So I'm going to let you tell your story. Um, I fell down the stairs seven years ago and broke my arm in two places and cracked my head open. And CRPS set in immediately. Um, I had two casts cut off because my hand kept swelling up and just started going to doctors. And I was fortunate to get diagnosed within about three months, but by that point I was frozen from my fingertips to my shoulder. Um, my hand was more like a catcher's mitt. It was huge and my quality of life was pretty nil, not, not real good. Um, I started having treatment then and had lots with not a whole lot, some success on some. I've had 50 plus nerve blocks and 20 lumbar blocks. Um, two years after I did my hand, I, it, I sprained my ankle and it traveled to my foot. I've had ketamine, I've had blocks, I've had therapy upon therapy, aqua therapy, massage therapy, mirror therapy. Um, well, you didn't give up on those nerve blocks, did you? <laughs> <laughs> what? I, had, I did two a week for for almost five months. Wow. And um, the block made it numb, and it gave them the ability to, because I had halidania so bad, to work my hand to try and get some movement back. And it did. It, that's, it, it gave me a quality of life back, because I had none for quite a while. So the blocks helped for that, but they were very hard on my on my neck. I have lots of scar tissue now on my neck from so many blocks there. Um, I have been, my, we've figured out that we've spent between two hospitalizations, one an accidental overdose, one a purposeful overdose, and on my treatments, we've spent nearly a million dollars between insurance and us. We've probably spent, how much, honey? 50, 200,000, us, maybe? But insurance, we've, the total amount of money between drugs and treatments has been close to a million dollars, and um, still didn't get to where I needed to be until I got here. And um, like I said, one, one time I had an accidental overdose that I was in the hospital for a week. And the second time was a purposeful overdose that put me on life support for a while. But I'm still here. And I came here. My pain level, heavily drugged, was about a seven. And I'm leaving here with no drugs and I'm less than a one, most of the time a zero. I'm excited to be a part of life versus being on the fringes of life. I knew that I would always participate in life, but there was always a heavy toll to pay for it. And um, I have grandchildren. I can play with them places besides the pool now and hold them and do more than read books and do puzzles. I can go on adventures with my husband who likes to do lots of adventures and um, not be afraid of them. Bill, you want to come up here? Okay. You're such a big part of our journey. Sorry, Marty, I didn't mean to interrupt you. No, that's that's my journey. It's been quite a journey. I am uh, been truly surprised, and I want to say thank you to everybody because Martha didn't do it by herself. She might come to the clinic. She came every day, and she said, "Oh, this person and that person and the other person and their their journey." She couldn't have done it without the support. And then I got here thinking that we're going to see a chiropractor, which, no offense, but I've never been a big fan. <laughs> <laughs> but it's, it's, it's so many things. It's nutrition, uh, Dr. Penley. Brilliant, absolutely brilliant woman. A brilliant doctor. Um, the physical therapy, I wanted to try it. You're all Olympic athletes in my mind. To have enough internal strength to face him and whoever else does it every day you're all athletes the vagus nerve I didn't know anything about the vagus nerve first day she had some results I, nobody does that I threw up every day for seven years and set week two of you know, vagus nerve therapy I have not vomited since I mean amazing but we don't know what it does. I mean, maybe you know what it does. Maybe if you were tell me, I wouldn't. It wouldn't sink in anyways. Not all that bright with that kind of thing. 
So, but it was just, it's so much more than what we thought it would be with the, then you go to the biofeedback and the emotional support and it's just so much, much more than just a, just an office where you go get a, a, a you know, a checkup. So anyway, I want to thank everybody for all the help Mark they got because I get my life back too. I get my wife back like she was when I first met her. Not that that was a bad thing, but for those of you that are, are the, are the uh, caretaker or loved one, it um, your journey is different than theirs, but you get the, the phone call and is it something really bad or, or not? And I, not having to have that fear anymore is really, really a good thing. Thank you. I love what I'll make you guys so much. I'm so proud of you. It's so hard just not to bowl with here. You deserve to ring this bell. <laughs> This is really bittersweet. I mean, I have so many wonderful relationships here with patients, with caregivers, with the staff, with, it's, 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 it's I, I can't talk about it. It's just so much. The whole synergy, the energy, the love, the compassion, the understanding that's here is beyond words. It's, you can't replicate it. It's, it's spectacular. Um, just before we go, I mean, I know you, it was touch and go. You almost lost your life. I almost lost my life. I was on life support. I was intubated. And you tried. You went to Italy. Uh, well, with near Spinal cord stimulator. And you're here because of Tanya. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Thanks, Tanya. Thanks, Tanya. <laughs> Who you met in Italy. Um, if anyone's watching this today and they're in a bad place, uh, anchoring hope on your moment, what, what would you say? about I, the money, the, the hugeness of this decision. It's, the money is a, a huge piece, and um, but the quality that you get, you can't put a price tag on it. I, um, it, there's no, I have my health, I have my life, I have, I can go forward. I, that's something I couldn't buy. And so the money that we spent here, I would mortgage my house, I, would, I wouldn't sell my children, but I would think about it. You, know? <laughs> it's, you can't put a price tag on the quality, and it, seeing how though I've, gone to Italy, I've done so much treatment, and it, it was money wasted. It didn't do anything. And the amount of drugs that I've taken, I can think again. I have dignity. I have integrity. I can go forward in life in a way that I, I didn't, I, I came here with no hope. I, I tried so much that, that failed that I, when I came here, I went, okay, one more thing, we'll see. And by week two, it was like, why? This is starting to work. I can feel some difference. I mean, it was it was amazing. Um, so the money is a very small piece of the quality that you get here, it's, in my opinion, and bills and everybody else's that's here. I think. So I thank you for what you've built here. It's 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 pretty phenomenal. One patient like you makes it work. 